Hey guys are here hope all is well good morning to you it is 10 12 a.m watching finally seeing some structural breaking going on here on the nasdaq and possibly on the s p and the dow for sure let's bring it back here guys i'm going to wait for this candle to close liking what i'm seeing here 45 seconds left in this one minute candle that would be far too big there for me 30 seconds left. Twenty seconds. Twenty seconds. Watching the three sisters this whole time. This might help to explain what I'm looking for. Right there, Dow leading the charge. Buy stop order now, guys, right above that wick. Buy stop order. Risking 30 to make 50. It's a 1.67R. First, it would be the first trade of the day if I get triggered in here. Still watching the three sisters very closely. See that there, boom. Watching. Patience now. We need to get triggered in here. This is a stop to buy for those who are new to my videos. It'll only get triggered if prices slam through that white line you see there. We're firming up here a little bit, guys, on all three. Show it to you very quickly here, here, and here. Need the doubt to kind of lead the charge here. Here we go. Rejection wicks, big rejection wicks here, guys, on the 30 minute, and that's important to the trade as well. Rejecting from yesterday's low. Broke through earlier, as you can see here with these wicks, right? And then now, and I'm in guys, I just got triggered in to this trade. Looking for 50 points on this. I'm gonna manage risk very quickly here. If I get the chance, looking for 50 points. Targeting 284. Targeting 45 now, guys. I just need it to slam back up there again one more time. So I pulled my target back to 45. I just need it to get back there. I'm seeing this rejection. Stop at uh, break even here, guys. Stop at break even. Stop at break even, being patient here. Managing my own impulse control here and a little bit of regret, which is normal. I've 
you know, I should have taken 45 points or should I have taken 40 points? Why did I go for 50? It, uh, maybe I was asking too much of it and so on and so forth. But I'm good with what I did here from a symmetrical standpoint proportion. I think it's a fair target. Looks like I might have to give it all back though and take a break even. Let's see. We've actually tapped VWAP on uh, on this. You know what? I'm going to put it back at 50, guys. I'm going to go from my original target. I'm seeing a renewed a renewed buying here on the three sisters. Let me show it to you very quickly. NASDAQ, S&P, and now above VWAP, just marginally on the Dow. I'm going to go for the 50 again. Very tricky here today for me. Some days you're very much in sync with the market and you can really feel it and some days you don't. This uh, price action is not, it's not comfortable for me and uh, we all have days like that looking for, like I might get stopped out break even here guys. Put you on pause for a moment here, guys, and I'll bring you back. We get some movement here. Slowing down a little bit, isn't it? All right, guys, I'm seeing an orderly pullback here on these. I'm going to bring my stop back down again, but only to 21 points. See that there? You don't see me do that very often, bringing my stop back again once I've moved it. But this is, uh, this is part of the dance, right? Getting new information, candle anatomy, candle biology, and I'm going to show it to you how we see this nice orderly pullback on all three of them. Um, Dow remaining a little bit on the strong side here, so that's what I want to see. And I'm going to give it a little room to breathe here instead of at break even uh, to be able to get that re re renewed buying interest here on the bottom of these wicks. We'll see if that comes. And I'm still going to look for that 50 points here. Uh, risking 21 let's make it 20 shall we just make it a nice round number and I think that's fair now 
Now, this is not the same. For those who are new, this is not the same as moving your original stop backwards to give the trade more room. I didn't even go back as far as the, my original stop, right? Remember, I moved to break even. And, uh, incorporating new information, giving it a bit more room to breathe, kind of dancing, you know, giving it a little dip and then bringing it back up. Moving forward, two steps backwards. This is the kind of thing we're talking about here. And being nimble and flexible with... Um, with your day trading and, and scalping is absolutely critical to your success. And this is about the letter of the law versus the spirit of the law, right? Understanding what you're doing emotionally and the drivers, the impulse drivers behind uh, what you're doing at all times. I'm getting sloppy now. So now I'm not loving what I'm seeing here on the three sisters. See that there, that weakness? Instead of the renewed buying, it might still happen. I do like this break and then retest of the breakout point here on the S&P. I just need the others to cooperate here a little bit. Here we go, hopefully. guys talking to myself of course Still alive here, guys. Still alive. Just being patient. Ooh. 1026. Something just happened. It happened in all three of them. Let me show it to you. Okay. Bouncing back a little bit here. Still alive. So you can see how I would have been stopped out of break even right there. And now I may get stopped out at a 20 point loss instead. That's a chance I'm willing to take given. The price action that I'm watching here and that's why I gave it a little bit more room and even willing to take a 20 point hit in favor of staying with this
patiently waiting. I know it's painful here a little bit. Still being supported here somewhat by a, a lack of selling on the NASDAQ, S&P, and the Dow. Dow is still holding up the strongest, and that's why I'm, I'm trading that one from the long side. Looking for those 50 points now. Tell you what, I am going to play it safe and move it to 45. Move it back to 45. This is the dance. Again, because we're not seeing the follow through on the S&P here or the NASDAQ. Looking to take this as a, as a sign. Being remarkably patient with this, guys. And that wasn't to toot my own horn, it's just a uh, horn. It's just that this is the way market action has been lately. I mean, the VIX is, is uh, 13.68, below 14 now. And that can cause uh, issues uh, for many, many traders in case in point right now. Patience, and just trusting the model. Ask yourself, would you have this kind of patience to sit through this, given what we've just seen? You want more big push here, guys. One more big push for 45 points. Let's watch us on the big screen, shall we? One more. There it is, guys. Thank you for being with me. Wow. So make, doing that dance move by moving the stop back from um, break even saved me from a break even trade and gained me therefore 45 points in a win and so sometimes we need to do that and be patient with the model and take in new information that new information of course was over here on the one minute candles on the nasdaq and the s p the three sisters and uh, to look for agreement thank you again for joining thank you for clicking that like button if you're enjoying at all uh, what we're doing here appreciate the support say hi in the comments if you don't mind too love to get to know you at least digitally have an amazing rest of the day and rest of the week take care